Good morning. So today we're going to be learning how to describe shapes. But first we're going to read a book. So while I'm reading, I want you to have a good look at all the pictures and see how shapes are used. So our book today is called Watcher Building. Watcher. That doesn't sound like proper English, but it does sound Australian. Watcher Building is written by Andrew Daddo and illustrated by Stephen Michael King. Let's find out what they're building. Watcher Building. Every day on his way home from school, little Davy Durack would stop and watch what was happening to the old milk bar on the corner. And every day, big Bruce the Builder would say g'day to little Davy. One afternoon, Davy asked Bruce for some wood. You're gonna make something, asked the burly builder, stuffing his singlet back into his shorts. But little Davy didn't say. He thanked big Bruce for the wood, jammed it into his school bag and hoofed it home. Like Melbourne rain, Davy was back again the next day. He asked for some more timber. Anything special, matey? asked Bruce. Some of that would be good, said the boy, pointing. Maybe thin a bit and something longer. You must be making something pretty good, mate. Something special. Little Davy smiled, put the wood under his arm and walked off. Every day that started with school would end like this. There were lots of bits of wood and lots of different weather. Big Bruce didn't ask what the wood was for and little Davy didn't say. Until one day, Bruce couldn't stand it any longer. Mate, seriously, what are you making? He asked. It must be pretty fantastic. Davy's lips stayed shut. It's a cubby house, Davy. In a tree, maybe. Big Bruce could imagine exactly what it was like. But little Davy Durack shook his head. Are you making a rocket ship, big fella? Is it a boat, maybe? Putting together your own Ferris wheel, are ya? Want some wheels for that, Billy Cart you're building, Davy? Is that what you're making? Little Davy smiled. I really can't say. It's a roller coaster, isn't it? Big Bruce could see it now. You're building a plane, aren't you, son? And you're building a hangar, too. I really couldn't tell you. And off went Davy Jurak with his bag, full of short bits and long bits tucked under his arm. It's a scarecrow. You're building a scarecrow. Or is it a skate ramp? Of course it's a skate ramp. What kid wouldn't want to build his own skate ramp? That's definitely what you're building, isn't it? But little Jurak never let on. As big Bruce the Builder packed up his truck, he tried to imagine what his little mate was building. A space station or a surfboard or a natty wooden bike. He couldn't stand not knowing, but it really was time to go. Little Davy sang out to big Bruce from the other side of the road. What are you going to do with the milk bar sign, Bruce? That old thing. I reckon I'll chuck it. Unless you want it, Davy. Can I help you carry it? There's the sign. So little Davy Jurak and big Bruce the Builder 
walked from the brand new super size super schmick corner store past the chemist past the hardware store the car park and down the street to the big backyard at Davy's place. What do you reckon? said little Davy. I reckon it's perfect mate, said big Bruce. It's exactly what this town needs. That was a fun story, wasn't it? He built a chicken house out of all the leftover wood from the old milk bar. But my question is, did you see any shapes? Let's have a look. Here we are. Can you see what's interesting? This is all drawings, but do you recognize some of these things from your house? It is a little milk bottle and a cup. You're right, it does look a bit like a telephone or a TV remote. But what are some shapes that we can see? Some circles, squares and squares inside the squares. What about over here? Some rectangles, some circles, Lots of shapes.